Hello there. In this video, I'm going to go over how to connect to your office computer from anywhere else with your remote desktop client on your computer. So first, before you go to your remote location, check your office computer and uh, you'll need to check just a couple things just to make sure that remote desktop is enabled and you want to make sure to get the right address that you'll use at your remote location to connect to your computer. So first, let's go ahead here on Windows 10. I'm going to go to the start menu and there should be a little gear icon for the settings. So go ahead and click on that. And once your settings window shows up, you'll want to go over here to the top left hand corner and click on system. And once the system options come up, you'll scroll down to the bottom here and look for the remote desktop item. So click on that. And this first option here at the top for enable remote desktop, if it is set to off, go ahead and switch that over to on. And then the other thing to uh, keep in mind is to make a note of the address that is showing up here on how to connect to this PC. Now this one uh, should work, but if it does not, I have another way for you to get the full host name of your computer. In your web browser, you can go to smu.edu slash hostname. and it will bring up another version of this address. So I would actually make note of both of those addresses just in case if one does not work, you can always try the other one. So uh, you will go ahead and take note of that information and then you will make sure again that the remote desktop is enabled right here and then you can move to your remote location to get set up there. Okay, so now I'm at my remote computer so I'm gonna go ahead and try to connect to my machine in the office. Before I do that, I need to make sure that I'm connected to the VPN. So whenever you get to your remote computer, make sure you have the VPN client installed and connected. And for more information on how to do that, stop by smu.edu slash VPN. But uh, right now I am connected to the VPN and ready to go. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go to the search bar here in my uh, task bar here at the bottom and I'll just start searching for a remote desktop. And of course it's gonna show up as one of the top uh, results. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that. And now here we are with our remote desktop connection client. So now here in the computer field, I'm going to type in the address that I took from my office machine to uh, make sure that I'm able to connect to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and type that in. Okay, and so now I'm gonna go ahead and click connect. And now it's going to prompt me for my username and password. In this case, I've connected to this machine before, so it already saved my uh, ID number, so I just have to type in my password. But if it's the first time you've connected to this computer remotely, you will need to enter SMU backslash, followed by your ID number as the username, and then your password. But right now, I'm just going to go ahead and type my password here. Okay, and if you want it to remember the credentials, go ahead and check that remember me box. But right now I'm just gonna go ahead and click okay. And it may prompt you for a certificate or to accept a certificate. Go ahead and click yes there. And then within a few seconds, it will log you in to your remote computer. So now you can actually use your computer that is here on campus in the office as if you are sitting right in front of it. And you can do this from anywhere. Just always, as always, make sure that you are uh, on the VPN in order for this to work properly for you. But that is how to connect to a computer remotely. Uh, if you have any questions or run into any issues, please feel free to call the IT Help Desk at 214-768-4357 or help at smu.edu. Thanks.